Hello. Hey. How you doing? Yeah. Good. Good. Yeah. Mm hmm. Too many hell bugs. Okay, good. Yeah, we're defending. Oh, yeah. I'll pound that bottom. Walk in here. Yeah, that's right. That's why his fucking other army's running, dude. Running. Oh, no. Who died? Ingjald Hammer? Ingjald Bulison? Oof. Spanked him. Oh shit, I captured the king, like the first fight. <laughs> I put their king in jail. You, you win? Yeah, the king of Alba. What's up, I criminals? How do I tell if I'm fertile or not? How come I always have a different accent every time I join? It's because you don't say it anymore, so it uh, slowly changes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How are you? I, I thought about you today. Oh yeah? Yeah. What's that? How's that? I, I don't know. I don't know why. I don't remember. You're like beating your meat, and you're like, oh yeah, Max. <laughs> Max, <laughs> dude, I miss that guy. He used to play games yeah. with us. Figures. No, no, I try to play games with you guys, and then for weeks, you didn't play games. Hard. Hmm. I'm about to quit my job, so. Why? Because unemployment's about to get the stimulus again, and then I'm going to be up, become unemployed because I'm going to, like, mysteriously accidentally get COVID or something. <laughs> so you're not going to quit. You're just going to be, like, incapable of working somehow. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. no, Max. Why, dude? Why do you do this? Well, I don't feel like working anymore. No, I'm same. Same as these. Going back to bad habits. About to make some quick money. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Actually, I'm about to go to bed, but... There you go, yeah. That's, 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 that sounds real. I haven't shaved in, like, two weeks. I look like a fucking mountain man. Most people <laughs> haven't shaved in two weeks. I don't remember when I last shaved, yeah. Hmm. Where's the king at? He's not in my jail. He's on house like arrest? That, wouldn't you? I'm looking for him. Hey, you know those deer that were always like, hanging out and eating right outside my work? Yeah. Somebody complained to Springdale about the deer eating their flowers and they fucking got rid of them. What a dickhole. What do you mean by got rid of them? They exterminated them. Really? Yeah. It's illegal to kill deer in Austin. Isn't that fucked up? No, I don't think they exterminate them. I think they somehow got them to move or something. They shoot them. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> like, they were awesome, too. They got to the point where I could, fe like, feed them out of my hand. Yeah, I believe that. Yeah, it's so aggravating. That's why I'm quitting, actually. Because <laughs> of the deer. Yeah. I mean, I get free food every day. I probably eat, like, $70 in free food a day. Yeah? Yeah, it's just... I don't know. Yeah. 
that's yeah that's the benefits of a job I guess or some jobs and, and you know what you don't even have to cook it isn't that crazy I know I just fucking go up to a computer and punch it in <laughs> somebody sends it out <laughs> you don't even have to talk to anyone and food is made for you that's crazy I know I don't know man I'm getting sick of the food, though. Yeah, you've had... Well, that's when you become friends with the chefs and you find out what they're making. Yeah, no, they don't. They, 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 have like, they, they, they have will like a, make no, other stuff. Like a, what? No, they have a big rule about that. Oh, really? Mm. Yeah, you can't make anything that's not on the menu. What? Nothing yeah. that tastes good. It's Utah. <laughs> Nothing that tastes good. Yeah, everything's pretty bland. I'm getting tired of eating steak and clams every day. <laughs> yeah, I'd be tired of eating clams in Utah. <laughs> Where the fuck they come from? China, probably. God, you're probably right. I mean, probably. Mm-hmm. Oh, I think I just woke up again. No, Max, no. This is sad. Hmm. I'm sleeping at the end of my bed. Like long ways. Because they're Tristan and Fiona are both in my bed. <laughs> Tristan was in his bed and he woke up. Hmm. You're scared. I to go get him. It's those wild cats, wasn't it? Probably. <laughs> <laughs> he still talks about him. <laughs> we shouldn't have sent him after him. <laughs> no, it was Gerard's fault. It at is, the Marriott yeah. that night. I remember. We like, he jumped the fence. He jumped the fence, dude. Yeah, he jumped the fucking fence. And then I, yeah, you know what? I got him back. And due to the Wildcats. Yep. <laughs> See, doesn't that make, doesn't that sound make believe like made up? For yeah. Wildcats. Yeah. Like, Gerard's like, well, cats, and you fucking, like, climb right back over the fence. <laughs> That's, that sounds like something a little kid would have a problem with. Yeah. Like how they tell you quicksand's gonna be a big problem. In, in popular media. So I decided to, you know, order a wallet. And, um, well, it wasn't a wallet, it was a, a phone case with a little wallet thing built in. Mm -hmm. So I keep losing my debit card, and today I lost my debit card before I got it in. God damn it. <sighs> God. What's wrong with you? No, dude, I usually don't lose shit like that. Except... You just said you kept losing it. Oh, I kept, <laughs> like, losing it, like, around my house and stuff. Like, I'd forget where I'd put it. Or I'd... The days that I don't have them, I would just put my stuff in my little bowl. On my, on my kitchen counter. But when I have them, I have to hide everything. Today I was wearing gym shorts. I went to Thunder Junction for like four hours. No, no, I didn't lose it there, even though I went like down slides and did fucking monkey bars and crawl through shit. But I go to Walmart and I buy something and I fucking lose it. Hmm. Started yelling at the Walmart employee, fucking asshole. I was like, I just left, like, I put little, I put my card in the little credit card reader thing, and you have to wait for it, and it's like, do not pull out, and then it's like, please remove. Well, Tristan and Fiona were fucking being bad, and I accidentally left it in that little slot, so I, like, you know, walked out to the car, and I was like, oh shit, I left my debit card. So I got them out of the car, went back into Walmart, and it was gone. I'm like, all right, either somebody took it or an employee found it. And it was literally gone for like three minutes. Like my receipt, I didn't even take my receipt. My receipt was still in the little thing, like the little printer. And so I went to customer service and I'm like, I'm like, yeah, I just left my debit card. And the person over at the self-checkout didn't see anything or no one, you know, returned it to them. And they said, check over by you guys. And they're like, okay. And they like pulled out this big binder and they're like, was it a chase card? I'm like, no. I'm like, it's a debit card. 
and they're like, nope, we don't have anything. I'm like, well, could you call on your, uh, your like, walkie-talkie and see if any of, like, the employees, you know, might have picked it up or anything? They're like, nope, can't do it. I'm like, why not? And they're like, oh, sorry, just can't do it. They're like, we don't want somebody to steal your, your debit card. I'm like, so I'm like, so you're saying that if you announce that I lost my debit card to your employees, somebody's going to fucking steal it? And they're like, we just, we just can't announce that over the intercom. I'm like, I'm not asking you to announce it over the intercom. I'm like, <laughs> I almost took the dude's fucking radio. I started getting really fucking mad. And the girl over there standing in the corner, like, blatantly staring at me, getting frustrated with this stupid bitch, this stupid dude, was like, I can call the associates over the, over the walkie-talkie and ask, but none of them had it. And I'm like, all right. I'm like, well, can you review the camera at the the ch self-checkout station? They're like, oh, we're, we're, we're not allowed to do that. I'm like, then what are they there for? Man, I was on a fucking roll. I was getting heated real quick. Real fucking quick. I don't have these kind of interactions with people lately. <laughs> and I wasn't I've wearing a mask had anymore. These kind of interactions. And I wasn't wearing a mask. And I was fucking spinning. Oh no. I don't think that's anything to be proud of, my man. Actually, I wasn't spitting. But I did have a mask on until. Fiona reached up and grabbed it off my face and it broke one of the straps. The little disposable ones. Yeah. 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 I'm gonna get like a... You know how they have like little fart speakers? Where you hit the button and it farts? I'm gonna get like a fart... I mean a cough speaker. And just like make it cough. And just walk around Walmart coughing. Why do you want to go to Walmart? Yeah. Fuck those people. I want my debit card. <laughs> don't, know, lose. don't lose years, your debit card. Shit is 30 fucking years behind here. You just can't go in and get a temporary debit card like every other fucking bank in the United States where they can just print you out a temporary one. No, you have to wait two fucking weeks to get one. It makes me want to just switch to a different bank. Okay, yeah. we'll, we'll do that. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. You're, you're convincing yourself to do it, I guess. Yeah. Well, they, don't have, did. they don't have Capital One here, and the nearest Chase is 13 miles away. Oh, that's a that's a that's a 15 minute drive, dude. I don't... Yeah, if you're going what 60 miles an hour, or 55 <laughs> miles an hour. My nearest bank is way. like 700 miles away. I don't yeah. I don't go to my bank. Yeah, I, I I use I bank online. Uh, there's only the bank that I have only has one physical branch, and it's in another state. I don't well, even know yeah, where it's at, to be Capital honest. One, and the close Capital One is three hundred and something miles away. So. So what? You don't have to go there ever. Yeah, you do. Yeah, I do. I guess you do because you're like losing all your documents all the time. <laughs> Anyway, I'm not using Wells Fargo. That's a stupid, probably a good idea. Stupid fucking name. <laughs> and that's, doesn't have something to do. Doesn't have something to do with with the area you you even live in. What are you talking about? Utah and Wells Fargo. Yeah. Are they Mormon? I'm definitely not using them. <laughs> Do you know how much shit I talked about, like, Mormons and LDS? Like, I piss off a lot of people, especially in Utah. Well, why are you there? Yeah, why are you there, buddy? Because my fucking baby mama. That's okay. I'm gathering dirt on Caitlyn, and I've got a new line of it soon. Uh-huh. Just wait. She's going to be paying me child support. Not really. Mm-hmm. The 
Dude, you should have so many fucking viewers now. Since I came in here. Man, I got these guns from HEB. Mm -hmm. And they're like, they're terrible. They Dip them in like, some coffee. They taste like shitty sugar cookies. Oh no, I'm sorry. I was excited. What the fuck is HEB? <laughs> Herbert. <laughs> I don't know, I'm at Death's doorstep. No, no, no. Why? Is that just a grocery store there? I think I'm just getting old, man. 65. But a bitch ain't one. Oh, was stress level two. That's that's also kind of doing me in here. Your face was run by your rival. It was. I'm going to stop losing weight, down. maybe. Get your stress down. Yeah, you want me to go to a brothel? Oh, dude, I gained like five pounds. You might have to. <laughs> My stress is at zero right now. Yeah, this guy stresses easily. I don't know why. Uh, everyone else, aside from my first king, I've never had that. Haven't had the problem. No, you better watch out for big booty Judy. What? I don't know. Let's so, so call this chick at work, big booty Judy. Oh, yeah. I don't. When, I don't when say. I don't, I don't say it to her face, but she got a big uh, yeah. booty. I would imagine you would. <laughs> uh, I'm not into sexual. This is how this is how he quits. <laughs> <laughs> nah. Brandy, it looks like you're in a civil war going on over there. Yeah. Uh, what the fuck? Right, <laughs> Where did this person up. come from? She's been in here uh, listening to you make a fool yep. of yourself this whole time. Dude. Yeah, very. Very much so. What? Yep. Yeah. This is our coworker uh, Randy. We've met her before. Yeah, you've already is met. Is she the one that took my job? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, you you definitely... I wasn't going to give you that job, all right? What? Are you serious? Are you acting like you're my friend? <laughs> oh, nepotism? <laughs> I, I'm not... Dude, first of all... First of all, yeah. No, second, I'm not mom. acting, okay? Yeah. I see Third, we have more Amazon. important things I don't remember what about. it was. But like I sent the it. Civil War. You did a sage, uh, a sage house cleansing kit. So there's, I'm not sure <laughs> um, all of what's going on as to why everyone's civil warring with you. But did I really do that? Be, but yeah. a potential could be that uh, she got it. Yeah. yeah. Wait one second. But a potential <laughs> could be um, that um, you are, you have a bunch of vassals that don't like you because they don't have like positions on your court, um, and you're also bleeding a bunch of money so you may want to well it's kind of hard to like not have your arm you right fucking now. channel but um one thing that you could do after you win this war is disband your army so you save some money okay. uh, but for now you you're gonna want to try and win the war um yeah I don't... job is that at you all have... It looks like you have more people than them to, to win the fight. Um, this person heard me say something about Big Booty Judy. Yeah, yeah, you did. You always make a fool out of yourself, regardless yeah. of danger. <laughs> do you know sign? Hey, do you know sign language? No, she doesn't know sign language. I don't think. Damn. What are we? Why are these people naked? What religion are they? Yeah, that's that's what I was trying to figure out. Pro probably Mormon. What people? That's not how. Uh, there's, uh, I don't think that's how Mormonism the, um, works. That's the opposite of Mormon. <laughs> Mormon, yeah, they're like dressed from head to toe. You can't even see like, you can see their eyeballs. That's about it. <laughs> Where did I find these people who are fighting against you yet are naked? Let you know see. your eyeballs aren't even really balls. They're like ovals. Right? Yeah, well, they're oblate uh, steroids. Uh, yeah. Eye ovals didn't didn't. Because <laughs> they were ovals, not balls. <laughs> oh, bless you, good man. Oh, man. No, it's COVID. <clears throat> that would suck to lose your, I... your sense of smell and taste for a couple weeks. Uh, you've, would... you've never, you have never had a sense of taste, first of all. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Damn. Woo! Damn. Woo! That was good. Damn, yeah. yeah. Don't knock up a hooter, girl. Oh. <laughs> Where God is, damn it. 
Where did the naked people go? I swear we had. Some hey, but you know what? At least she was in a rap video, my man. I yeah, I can't. She was in a Paul Wall video. I can't say that for my lady. Yeah. So yeah. Yeah. I, I can't. I don't yeah. remember this statement. Uh, he. Yeah. We looked it up. He proved it to me. I I saw her and then saw her name in the credits actually. Why are Damn. these people naked? Yeah. Yeah. That's all I got. Sorry. Why aren't you naked? <laughs> is what is what they're saying. <laughs> I'm just curious why these people are naked. Because their religion is not like pro nakedness. Wait, what? <sighs> I forgot what I was gonna say now. This guy forced his way into my stewardship, and next time I fire him. I hate that. that. Call it, is that what they call it these days, Josh? Your, yes. Your stewardship. Like I, I fired him so that somebody You're else. Like all I did her. Was... Never mind. Real quick, I'm being black. Your mic you're... cut out. Yeah, well, all we heard was you're being black. <laughs> yeah, that's, oh, that's black that's so racist. I'm being black. Holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> being black male. By who? I'm being black. Um, by the head of tech. Your push to talk is not very good. It's not push to her. It's her microphone is a little, oh, a little oh, away sorry. away from her face. Is this the <laughs> HDMI chip? What? Yeah. What? Never, never mind. What? Remember the talk person was using HDMI instead of onboard video, or something. I'm out of here. What? <laughs> oh god. <laughs> um. Anyways, you're being blackmailed by the head of something. Did you say to start with a T? No, it's cool. I think I got it. Okay. Um, we're good. Okay, so you just want to win this war against these people that are fighting you. Um. It looks like you have a good amount of allies, but... Hmm. Direct, you might want to, like, propose a marriage to her and then figure out how you can assist in this war. Gladly. Alright, I'm good. Wait, where is she? Oh, Bjarmaland, right? Duh. Yeah. Um, allow me to browse her children. I have a truce with this guy for some amount of years. I can't figure out where that is. It's not under diplomacy. What? Okay, arrange marriage. How old is she? Five. Okay, uh-huh. Uh, my grandson is four. My son is eight. Oh, he's he's comely. Charismatic negotiator. Okay. Well well done, son. Well done. Okay, I have proposed a marriage. So how painful is it becoming futile? Not too bad. It's not too bad. I'll be over to help you in a bit. Oh, dude, I got green curry downstairs with some crispy tofu. These cats are just running around. Oh, I lost my 
Jesus Christ. Love. I wish Tristan would stop. What? I wish Tristan. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Hello? Hello? Is his microphone on, guys? <laughs> I, wish Tristan, I wish Tristan would stop waking me up, acting like a cat. He, he wakes up and he gets really close to my ear and goes, Meow. <laughs> so aggravating. I just want to slap the shit out of him. <laughs> oh no. Like it really pisses me off for some reason. I see. Um, okay. I understand. Does Mateo do that to you? No, no. He's throwing, he's going through the tantrum phase where, and he swing, he swings his arm. Like sometimes he tries to hit you, sometimes he just tries to knock something down. But the arm gets, yeah. gets swung, you know? Yeah, Fiona does that. You know what she does? She, she shoes shit out of my hand all the time. I don't want it. She shoes it. Get it out of here. <laughs> I see. Do you spank, do you spank, do you spank them? No. What? No. But he doesn't need it to. No, I'm just kidding. I just just today popped his hand. Oh yeah, I forgot he's only like two. Not even. Two months yeah. under two. Yeah, wait till like two and a half. <laughs> Wish you spanked that ass. Think about it. Give my kids away and just give them like a fleet of raccoons. Then just give give them the rabies and set them loose. Yeah, just dress them in Fiona and Tristan's clothes. <laughs> no, oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Brandy, I appreciate you playing with us, and I'm sorry that you have to endure this. I uh, zoned out to everyone. No, Perfect. She's not, she doesn't even fucking care. Look at that. <laughs> I gotta lose some stress, guys. I'm too stressed right now. I didn't invite you to a party, but... You know, oh, too stressed? I'm zero solid. stressed right now. Oh, you, yeah, he could vassalize you and invite you to a feast. <laughs> That would be comical. Alright. Uh oh. Uh -oh. What happened? Oh. Well, it's a uh, brandy left. I think she got tired of my danger shit, you know? I didn't. She didn't even hear what she's saying. So. She's like, I be black tomorrow. Yeah. Chicken. Fuck you, man. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna have to put him a danger on. T Time out. He I'm goes. Leaving. I'm, I'm, I'm leaving. <laughs> Bye. Have a good night. Bye. Bye. Bye, Mac. Yeah, sorry. Well, since she's gone, I'll hang up for a little bit. What? No, you're in timeout, dude. No. Why is this thing with Bernie Sanders going viral? God knows. Check out this one. I think this one's the best out of all of them. You don't even put it in the right channel. <laughs> well, because my Discord's bugged. Mm-hmm. Fine. I'll delete, delete. I have to disconnect to put it in the... You don't have to, no. Uh-oh. Oh, right, here we go. Is that better?
Alright, I'm really going to bed. I'll probably be back by. <laughs> Good night. Oh, now I suddenly have a lot of negative money. Wait, so they've left they left my capital and now they're hitting a different a different route? Or a different city? Has the danger just gonna run off all our coworkers? I guess. It is not my fault. I know that. Damn. My brother drank, drank himself to death. I'm about to hit stress level three and then probably die. Jesus fuck, negative 27 gold? It's expensive to be a. Uh, whatever. Is there a way for missions? Yeah, yeah, I knew I knew it was coming. <laughs> All right, let's see. Let's get a oh, baby. Get a pause in there, you know. Oh no, you lost. Kingdom. <sighs> it's the war I was fighting that I I thought I finished. Hmm. Uh, okay. Let me fill up my uh, is everyone, everyone's gonna try, yep. Okay, everyone doesn't hate me. That's, you know, there's some, there's some positive numbers in here. Damn, homeboy 75? How did he live so long? Oh my god. Negative 100, dude, why? I will want seat on the council. Okay, yeah, fix that. How's my wife, dude? My wife even kind of hates me, dude. Why? You know?
I think we can. Oops, I started us back moving again. RIP. Man, I have a lot of, I have low control in a lot of counties. Sheesh. It happens. Man, I want like something to snack on, and I feel mm -hmm. bad about it. <laughs> <laughs> Just get it. You get some ice cream. Yeah. Oh man, I, we do have ice cream too. Maybe maybe peanut butter and jelly sandwich. That might do it. Cause I was tempted to do it earlier, but I was like, nah, I'm gonna die. There's some point where I'm going to die. Peanut butter and jelly sandwich is not going to kill you. <laughs> uh, yeah, stress did, huh? There we go.
Wait, I thought moving up to feudal gave you more cultural mm. options, but it does not. Alright. There we go. I've pruned down our Crusader Kings 3 channel. <laughs> and as a side effect, mm -hmm. this voice channel. Right. What? Empty council position? What what happened? They just left? They're like, ah, fuck you, I'm out. Oh, hello. Hey. Welcome back. I was just messaging you. I, I uh, readjusted some permissions. Uh, and uh, this channel is now only open to people who actually play strategy games. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Woohoo. So that should uh, adjust some things. Oh, Gerard's in the Civil War. Yep. It, I knew it was coming. I, I, I was able to disband a couple factions, but... Okay. Couldn't you, get them you, all. Uh, you, did you use my tactics? My special tactics? I didn't. I didn't fuck any of my cousins. No. Wait. What just happened? Oh. Okay. Okay. Patrols can marry. I have not been able to marry my my son, Prince Strogel, because his <laughs> wife is has been in prison forever. Is she? Where is she in prison? But yeah, your um, do you, did your microphone get sent back to the other one in Discord? No, she's. Oh, maybe. Maybe. Hello. It could. It could be that. That could be the case as to. What has happened? Also, Gerard, I have a potential solution. Is that we could send her, uh, send Brandy one of those Samson um, meteors, those little desk mics. Mm -hmm. they're, they're pretty decent. Same one that like Shelby uses. And it's like zero problems. All right. While well, I was managing Discord permissions, the kingdom is in chaos now. I think we're we're resolving things. Okay. I am forty two, so I don't think I can have any more children. So I'm, I'm going to that old can have kids. It's true. Gerard, how old is how old was uh Myra's mom when she had <laughs> in her forties. Okay, so maybe that's true. But I really don't think I'm going to have any more children. I can just feel it. I have like an intuition as the Empress that it's, we're done. That being said, 
I will send invitations uh, across the lands for champions to become my new consorts. And then I will divorce my husband and... Are you going to murder him? Um, Can you... Are kids that come from your husband yours? Uh, husbands actually can't give birth. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Todd, welcome. Our I kids that come from my... I knew I should have faced that better. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, well, what do you mean, is my question. Yeah. Any kids that he has that are not from you. Oh, they do not become mine. They're like, that's my property. They become into my prison, mostly. <laughs> Oh, my mother? Nice. She's over I, here hanging out. Some, some peasants rebelled against me and I slaughtered them. So it worked out. I I granted them anatomy or autonomy, rather. Who? The peasants, because I'm fighting other wars. I, I didn't want to also have them coming and fucking That up. goes across every land, I think. I, I, does it? Fuck. I don't know. I thought it was just... No, it doesn't. It's only the county that they're most upset in or whatever. Okay. It seems. Very well, then. Oh, I didn't get my, my concubines in order, dude. <laughs> God damn it. Your cousin, your cousin. No, I don't want my cousins, okay? What's wrong with this game? Alright, my queen's, uh, you know. Okay, what now? She's, she's, you know? She's, she's know. pregnant. She's pregnant, sorry. No. And so, other things are popping up. <laughs> uh, okay, now she's my rival. What? My, your my, your rival? my aunt is my rival. Oh, that was that one. That one queen was my <laughs> rival. Uh oh, I might get fucked up here. This is tough. Man, shit's fucked up. That's what oh, I'm yeah. saying. They're about to. Call. Brandy could help you, but I think she's fighting her own war, which you're supposed to be helping out with. I was supposed to, yeah, and then my my dad died. There's a peasant uprising going on. There's... Yeah, I know. A war of independence that's striking out. <laughs> no, I, I settled the peasants. I'm a fucking She's allied pay some with people. A, nu a nudist, which I'm not sure what's going on there. <laughs> Why are they nudists? Military. Mercenaries. Eight hundred ten. Oh, they got 5,800? God damn. How many titles can I create? I think I need to create some titles. Hmm. wrapped up all these shires like Worcestershire yeah I got that I've been having that Warwickshire and Hertfordshire and Gloucestershire and Oxfordshire and Berkshire and Buckinghamshire and Hersfordshire and... do they have blankets in Berkshire I don't know it's do probably they, they invented blankets there <laughs> the soft ones Man, I don't want to go on a hunt. Hunting's not my thing. Actually, Lincolnshire. Fuck it, I'm going on a hunt. Staffordshire. Deer. Lincolnshire. There's too many shires. Oh, 
I want this person out of prison. Who's holding her? This nudist is holding her. Oh, 14% I die. <laughs> Fantastic. Disappointing. How do I get someone out of someone else's prison? Hey. I'm not good on hunts, apparently. <laughs> I need some prestige. How do I get more? Oh, that's because I'm under my consort limit. I need some men. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You need to hold counties, duchies, kingdoms. Yeah. Oh well, I'm I'm an empress, so I don't have a problem there. I just need more. Just don't be so greedy. All right. This man is robust. Does he have a wife? He does. my player air someone who I do not want to see. I need to manage this election before things get up in hand. Can anyone send me one gift of money? <laughs> yeah. Just one. I'm negative 20 and I want to hire a damn champion. Or re recruit one. There you go. Thanks. Oh wow, that's a lot of money. That's a lot of buckaroos, man. Well, that's just what you're worth. Okay, all right. So what are you going to do about this whole Kingdom of Gardarecki breaking off from you? And the Lataglians that have taken the middle of your kingdom. The Lataglians, I'm going to... Wait, where did Gardarecki break off? Oh, off from Gardar... You. Oh! You lost half of your land, my dude. Didn't even realize that. It's a thing. Yeah. 10% a thing. I'm working on it. I'll so have I... you figured out how to like command your army and stuff, Brandy? Like by selecting and moving them around to fight. Hear me? Uh, we did just now, but the, like, like the end there. 75% of the two words. We heard hear me. Your microphone might be set back to that other one, I think, is what may have happened. It sounds fine when she's coming through, but, like, she's not always coming through. I wonder what causes. Oh, my gosh. Can you hear the difference? Hi. Huh. Okay, well, yes, but also it may have to do with Discord's, um, the oh, yeah. setting that auto unmutes you or something. Um, so, in Discord, and I, there, I'll... 
So I think I'm already messing around with the item that you're talking about. Are you talking about where it like uh, determines the input background? sensitivity? Yeah. Okay, so I yeah, the automatically that. determined input sensitivity, if you move it to the left, then it'll pick you up when you talk uh, more often. Yeah, I bet that's it. I, to I totally forgot that. Like that levels? Anything's fine. Like, it's not, it doesn't increase your volume, it just tells Discord when to unmute you. So that way, if you're, like, doing things like, I don't know, drumming on your desks quietly, it won't <laughs> do anything, but if you talk, it'll, it'll unmute you. Yeah. I think, uh, got it. Thank you. I appreciate yeah. that. That sounds a lot better. That yep. might have fixed it. Absolutely. Things. We'll just see. We'll have to play with it over time. Oh, so did you figure out how to command your armies? No. Okay, so your armies, do you, have you, do you, well, let's see. How would you be able to find them? Um, oh, Todd, what are, you, what are you doing, buddy? I think they, they'll generally Going down a dark path. By them, which is like a, a boat uh, on a red background. It looks like you have, yeah, there, you do have some armies, and they're over in, uh, like, kind of to the left, like, below Finland, um, in that, that little area that still says the Armaland on it. Uh, My armies are always just a solid color flag, but depending on where they, what my rally point was they came from. Yeah, so your armies, let's see here, all are over Is not me so much? Okay. Your armies are all the ones with the like little uh, red boat things on them in that picture I sent you. Um, and they're over in Oops. In the picture. It's like right in the middle of this screenshot here is where, where your armies are, I think, or some of them. And so you, to command your armies, you just left-click the army and then right-click where you want them to go, and they'll automatically fight people when they get there. You generally want to move your armies together, and to select multiple armies, you can, like, uh, left-click and drag a box, a selection box around them, like you're highlighting icons on your desktop. Awesome. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, if you, if you have issues with that, just let us know and we'll, we'll walk you through it. People are raiding me. What? Fuck. I took my wife prisoner. It's gonna be tough. Tough, tough. Keegan, can you help me out? You have army nearby or not far? Nope. Keegan, do you think yeah. you could help me out? What do you need? Uh, fighting. Need help fighting. Oh. Yeah. That's bullshit. I, I do. Myself. Okay. Yeah, sure. Invite me to war. Are we married somehow? I don't think we're married, but I'll start working on that. You have children. Let me see if I have small children. <laughs> no, I can't give away Star Killer. No, actually, I could. Maybe. Oh, he's he's homosexual, so he might not. Actually, do you have any sons? Because maybe we could. No, that's not. That's a business. It doesn't matter if they're gay or not. They you can still. They're not there for love. <laughs> <laughs> oh, one of my daughters recently, their husband died. So, and she's a, kind of a shitter, so. All right, well, her. you know. Her name is Princess Mayer. Princess Mayer? Yeah. Of the... I want 
keep Prince Star Killer. You know. You have John Mayer. Do you want my zero-year-old son? It doesn't matter. Just get him married and let's go. Oh yeah, they're about to step on me, dude. All right, where do you need me? Anywhere? Yeah, I mean the fighting is happening on Nyland. Um, what's a what's a county that you wouldn't mind if I took over closer to you guys, so that could be we could be friends. I have uh, Zemagallians to the south, and it's Keegan is west of that, and I am north of that. It's like if you look at the map from zoomed out, you'll see Finland down there above White Russ. Yeah. Yeah. Zim, uh... Did you already lose your independence form? Looking for Zim. Uh... No, I have not yet. It's coming close though. It looked like you were in two wars at the same time. I'm at 75% though. Okay. Where are they trying to take over? Basically, the whole center area of Finland, it looks like. Where's your army? It's fleeing. I don't have a strong of an army as I used to, by the way. They're about 6,000. I have 3,200, but I'm, like, sailing as far away as I can, apparently. Call me to war? Do you want to call me to oh war? Oh, my God, I forgot about that. How do I actually yeah, do that? that's a thing. What is this place you were saying, Gerard? Um, Zemigallians? You'll see Finland if you zoom out. That's oh, just yeah, a... that's yours. Okay. Yep. Wow. I'm going to take this. That... Huh. Who could I take? That cell. It's a little island right there. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. You've, you've been losing some that. fights there, Gerard. Yeah, I've lost a couple. So I'm going to take your capital back. Okay. Start. That'll help. I, think. I mean, I could go straight up and fight him, but... I also have one of your people prisoner. <clears throat> yeah, my queen. I took my queen. My queen. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's gonna take me eight months to drive. Oh, my queen died. Damn, they got six months on their siege over there. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna send you some gifts and you can hire some mercenaries. Okay. I have 36 gold now. I know. find your armies, Brandy? Yeah, now I'm, uh, Okay. So you are at war. Let me see with who. Uh, peasant revolt. Oh, I'm pregnant. Wow, this consort oh. just <laughs> help, helped out, I guess. Yeah. You want me to hire, like, a shitty 800 strength? For 130 gold? Uh, oh, wait, no. Let me give you a moment. Um, so, do you see where the enemy army is in your territory, Brandy? It might be near your something. Can you tell me how to move them one more time? Yeah, so, uh, click 
so um, move your mouse uh, to to like um, above and to the left of both your armies, and then click and hold the mouse button down, and then move your mouse to the bottom right of your armies, and it should drag a box around both of them to select both, and then you release. Did that grab them? It should show you in the bottom left the card that, that shows like that you have them now. Let me see here if I can uh, help you out. Put a little square around them. Yeah, so you. Uh, oh, now they're like. Okay. Now you have it. Now it shows them selected in the bottom left? Uh, yes. Okay, so now right click in the territory to the right just a little bit, and it should move them. Okay, so, but. Instead of sending them that way, um, move the, move your um, screen uh, over near your capital and like right click over there to take it back. So do you, do you see how one of your territory has yellow stripes through it? It's near your big part. So yeah, tell your people to go to the cities over there. So there's like. You know, right where your big flag is, that's or your your emblem. There's a city there uh, called the Barony of Cargapol. So if you move your men there, then they should go to um, defend it. So just uh, with your army selected, right click over there, and then it should show an arrow of them moving that direction. Cool. Okay. So they're they're headed that way. Oh, I see them. They look like they're paused here. And yeah. Oh, I lost the fog of war there. But they should start walking that way once you right click. So you just drag a box around them with the left click. And then you right click on um, a city in that yellow territory, the yellow lined territory. How's this war going, Drew? Are you going to lose anytime soon? Um, I'm not sure. They'll finish a siege in two months, and then I'm not... I don't know. Oh, how to pay you more money for the mercenaries, right? Yeah, if you want better. I have 191 did gold you, now. Did you hire one already? No, I haven't. I have not. Well, I, I've hired, I hired one earlier, yes. Okay. Uh, how much more money do you need? I don't know. How big do you want to go? Mm -hmm. I'll send you one more. Okay. Uh, does that pay enough? A 300? Or about? I have like 294. Lot, lot. Uh, 319 is the next, like, it goes from 789 to 1538. So if I get, I think, one more. Yep. Do you need, like, more and more money than that? No, that, that'll, that'll hire something. Get them on that raid. All right. Oh no. What? My uh, wife is now his concubine. What? Yep. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna have to fuck him up. How do I? Isn't there a trait where you can like pay people for certain things? Um. Sounded kind of vague. You can, you can pay people for, uh, what would you call it? Their titles, or you can pay to get a claim on something. Maybe it's under diplomacy. Sounds like a hook. Let's see here. Hey, is that you got is that genius daughter available? Hell no, dude. No? No, you're not even for a king? No. A, a freshly 
<laughs> What's that? Which one are you talking about? Ingfrid. Ulfhild Strodetir <laughs> Svensson. Oh, wait, let me see. Ingfrid? Is that even your child? No, oh, maybe not. Strolana, say. No, Strolana is my next in line to become. She's a, she's lesbian too, so she's not even interested in your shit. See, I was, I was about to ask for her, but then I was like, nah, he wouldn't go for that. Yeah, hell no. <laughs> These see. are prized daughters. They're set to like take over the world one day. Hey, I need you over here to defend. Uh, where? Right. Oh, yep, on my right. way. Yes, sir. We're gonna go fuck them up. We're gonna let them tangle us, and then we're gonna tangle them. Yep, yep. Though I don't know how long it'll take us to, like, get there to help, but... Uh, predicted arrival is December 31st, 1034 for me. So a month. You're, you're a step ahead of me. Days. 26 days versus 25 days. Okay, so... We're going to... Oh, wait. No, no, no. That's there. Oh, shit. This is going to be close, I think. I got 31 days or 30 days now. Oh, wow. I'm winning. Oh, I'm not winning. No. <laughs> we're coming. We're coming. How that's, long How long does the fight go for? Oh, my men are good ladies here. Mm -hmm. I should have pulled them out sooner. This well, is I mean, not gonna go well. They can't Unless um get your butthole over here. Yeah, I'm moving. You're gonna you're gonna land first though. I know. Um Yeah, that's okay. He softened him up for us, you know? Uh also I can only lose fifteen percent max more for fighting, so that's that's not going to be the game changer here. The sieges are going to be the game changer. Oh, you're already in there. I'm coming. It says we're going to win. I'm pretty sure. I just had a daughter, and she's not very remarkable, so feel free to send a proposal. <laughs> Oh yeah, we're gonna beat the shit out of them now, dude. I will name her Alliance. With a J. Okay. <laughs> uh. I was I was telling Brandy how you she's like, what is what's what's Strell? And I was like, I don't know, he just fucking adds J's to names. Uh, it makes them unique. Okay. So Alliance with a J. Yeah. Oh, look, your army is back. Taking shit over, Brandy. You're figuring it out. Okay, so you know how you have two armies in there? Yes. I'm going to teach you some advanced stuff. So go ahead and drag a box around your armies there. Okay. So, when you have both your armies selected, do you see how there is, um, in that bottom left uh, card there are like two little flags and they have like a number with a K after it. See that? You do see that? Perfect. Yes, okay. I see that. So hold shift and click on one of those flags and it should get rid of one of them. And by click, I mean left click. Did it, now it only has one of the armies selected? Yes. Okay. So now, with only one of the armies selected, go ahead and right-click on the other city in that conquered territory. Or I think that's how that works. Is that how that works? Uh, what, what, think. what are you trying to do? Sorry? What's that? I'm trying to interpret stuff. Oh, you actually just won your war, Brandy. So if you want to go ahead and click the war icon in the bottom right, you can just enforce demands. Nice. So it looks like you, you defended them. Thank you for your help. Yeah. Keep winning all these wars. Okay. Once you do that, 
you're going to want to, so click the enforce demand. Let me know when you do that. I do not see the enforce demand. Uh, so uh, oh, I have to go to the war thing. Okay, got it. Okay. Okay, cool. so you did. Now, if you look at the very top of your screen, your gold, it shows that you have negative 1,724 gold, and you're losing 14.6 per month, right? Yep. Okay, so go ahead and click disband troops, or disband armies, at the bottom right. They have been disbanded. Okay. Now... You are only losing 0.3 per month. So, how else can you earn money? Let's see. Um, making your vassals like you will actually increase their ability to do stuff. Um, do you have any council, council positions open? Because you have some vassals that do not have... Uh, positions on your council uh, that want to have them. Is that the grant vassal? Wait, where do you do that? Where do you like let someone on your court or whatever? On your council. So the the right side of the screen, there is a chair or throne icon. It says it says council. It's like teal. Okay. So you can oh, click. Oh, yeah, I have one spot. Okay, so you want to give it to one of your powerful vassals. Um, to figure out who your powerful vassals are, as you scroll through the candidates, so which uh, which position is it that's open? Steward. Okay, steward. So if you click the plus icon, it's going to bring up a list of all the people you could appoint as a steward. Do you see the little, like, in that window that pops up, there is an icon that has a chest with coins on it. Um, it's on the yes. right side. Okay. If you hover over it, it tells you what it's going to do, which is sort by stewardship skill. So click that. And then do you see how now every character, it's from the people who have the most green stat to the least green? Yeah. Okay, so I so want the one with the most money? Not quite, because as you scroll down, look at the character portraits. And what you're going to look for is a character with a fist next to their portrait, and this means they're a powerful vassal. You're looking for red fists, which means they're a powerful vassal that's not already on your council, whereas yellow fists mean they're a powerful vassal that is on your council. While so you were it's... talking, I clicked on one, and I never... <laughs> uh, I, clicked on the... I clicked on one with a red fist, though, that was, like, negative 100, and now she's only negative 30. There oh. you go. See, that's what you want to do, because now that she likes you more, she'll start to pay you more taxes. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. You asked me about this earlier. I'm so sorry, Brittany. Um, she asked me earlier how you can keep, like, make your council happy. And one, yes. of, one of the ways is to sway. Sway is just a free thing you can do constantly on someone. Sometimes they'll take your advances as romantic, though. I've had that happen when I was, like, trying to, like, sway my male priest. <laughs> and he was like, oh, <laughs> Would you like yeah. to dance? And I was like, uh, <laughs> I'm married, sir. Coming together. This person is still fucking in prison. Get out. I just want I just want her out of prison. You can also oh Brandy, also your chancellor, you can focus on domestic affairs and it that will slowly increase all of your council's opinions of you as long as they're your vassals. So they'll it slowly increases your vassals opinions. And the longer your chancellor is performing that action, the 
more, it'll increase the opinion uh, each month or something like that. Like, to prevent you from cycling between foreign and domestic affairs. Like, if you focus on one or the other, it benefits you more. I figured out how you can free people from prison, I think. I just paid the person who's in prison gifts. And so now they may be able to pay their own way out of prison. Uh... Okay, so your goal is to kind of try and work your way out of debt, uh, Brandy. Got it. Um, what's the best way to do that? Is there a good way to do that? Shit. Realm will lose land when Vassal dies. Who's his... Um, if you hover over your um, money loss uh, at the top, Brandy, does it tell you the reasons for it? So if you hover over your gold at the top, it should tell you what are your negatives. Um, I don't know how to say this word. Profligate? Is, am I reading? I'm sorry. Oh, oh, huh. Hmm. That means you just spend a lot, doesn't it? I see. Yes. Um, what is what is your biggest negative, like under monthly expenses? My income is negative ten percent. Uh, yeah. Uh, well, under so you, did you hover over your gold at the top and it says monthly income, month, monthly expenses? Okay. Um, it should give you like values like minus, you know, five gold for this or minus two point three for this. Like, I have minus 17.5 for my raised armies. So. I'm... What? We can't hear you. Uh oh. The, this time it's not Discord doing it, it's your microphone, like, warbling a little bit. Okay. Is that better? Yes. Yes. Okay. Um, so I have negative 1.2 for unraised men at arms, and then the only other negative I have is the profligate negative 10%. Everything else is plus. Okay, so you have raised men at, it says unraised or raised men at arms? Unraised? Unraised, okay. Hmm. Yeah, because you don't have that many. Oh, because you're putting armies back together right now. Okay. Click your military tab on the right side. Click your military icon, the shield, cross swords. Got it. And then do you see that at the bottom it says monthly reinforcement? Yes. If you uncheck that, if you uncheck that, does your money, like, do, do, do you start to be able to gain more money? Uh, it might take, uh, like, a month to, so uncheck it and then wait a month and then see if it changes. Okay. Not cool. not a month real time, but like a month in the game. Yeah, I gotcha. <laughs> Thank you. Mm -hmm. Do you need my help fighting over there, Jordan, or are you about to get into a fight that you're gonna lose? Um, they're walking over. I have better numbers. Cause I have one month before I can win this fight, and then I have, um, uh, and then it will take me forty-four days to walk to you. So, they'll get in a fight before you can. You have better numbers? Or are you sure of this? I think so. Cut away. How do we get close enough to start a war? I guess we just have to buy good pieces in that direction. I'm actually going to send my boats your way, Drag. Thanks. They're on the way. Thanks. And we're going to crush them all. Yeah. Let me see what I can upgrade stuff in.
Oh yeah, they're coming. They were. It looks like they were raising more armies or something. You have 4,400 now. I have 4,500. But they're definitely moving towards me. My boats are due to land. Nice. Bring, bring your 2K over? Yeah, perfect. 2K. Challenge everything. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> Alright, so far it says it's a green. It's a green. Well, how do you see that? I don't oh, know. So you have your army selected and it's going to do a thing? Jay, my men have landed. They're beating the shit out of them. Beautiful. We ripped someone's head off. Yeah. I see that. Oh, we're winning. Yeah. Like, this is what you wanted. Okay, so your gold has started to go up a little bit. Um... Okay, in your council, uh, mm -hmm. can you click your council, Brandy, and then do you see under your husband there is, like, some, wait, there's an assist ruler button? Oh, yes. no. He's not very good at stewardship. That might be why things are sucking a little bit. What's the skill of your steward? The number next to them. Five. Wait, which number? Oh, five. Oh. Ah. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> Blackmailing me again. I think I chose the wrong option while they were blackmailing me. Ah. Uh, did someone break off from you? You've been exposed as a murderer and a familial kinslayer. I mean, like, it's not that bad. <laughs> um, you know, it means people like you a little bit less. Oh, my queen is not attracted to men. Damn it. <laughs> I should have looked at that. Ooh. Hey, we completed public works. War is starting to turn around for you, Gerard. Yes, w with your help. I appreciate it. I know. Here, go ahead. Siege these cities here. Oh, one of my contracts expired. It's been three years. God damn, really?
Have you just been murdering people, Brandy? Is that what you've been doing? I only murdered that baby. That's yeah. right. Uh -huh. Small child. I'm not very experienced with how to get more taxes, so well, let's see. I've been uh, building. Yeah, upgrade your tax building? Well, no, I mean in Brandy's situation where she has negative 1500 gold. Oh. Oh man. We'll see. Uh, you know, I was like that at the very, very beginning of the game, and it just took me forever to get out of it. Wait, wait, wait. Do you have control? Are all your counties in control? You have control of all your counties? Because they, you, they don't pay you taxes if you don't. Oh. Click, uh, Brandy. Go to council. Click on. Your marshal, there's a lock and key, or a key and a lock. Click on that. And then it should take you to a map with blue and red. Are you are you saying stuff? Um, okay. So you oh. need to go to the marshal dude, right? Yeah, yeah. So then you have there's a circle with a key and a lock. Click on that. Look, you gotta find what place you wanna. Well, it'll it'll highlight all the red. Oh, I want to know how much red she can see. The redder it is, the the less control. Uh huh. I understand what you're saying now. Just give me one second. Okay. So the chancellor can do domestic affairs, which does something. It uh, increases the vassal opinion. Yep. Okay. So, um, I found the guy finally. What do I do now? Oh, click on the lock and key in the bottom left corner. Of his little window. You've said that like 90 times to me. I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> and then it'll turn your, your map blue and red. How much red is there? I'm still looking for this lock and key. I'll send you a picture. If you click on council, it's the, the bottom left button. That is, I thought it was a grave, everyone. <laughs> that's funny so okay so now that you've clicked on it and you're looking at your your map what counties are red and what how many are blue I would bet it's uh, red. well uh one two three four sorry i won't count out loud well, it depends on, like, how red they are, you know? Yeah, the reddest one is probably what you want to focus on. Okay, so yep. there's eight red, and then there's a whole bunch. There's... Okay. So, you, yeah, you'll want to focus on the most red, red one. Because, uh, they, what that okay. does is it lowers the amount of taxes you pay. And other, other bad things happen, start happening as well. It, and it takes time. It'll take two years or something like that, right? So. Oh, this lady's been in jail for 57 years. Damn, dude, you're savage. How old was, was she, like, zero when you jailed her? She's 71. God. What if I just let her out? Yeah? Why not, you know? She's been in there for how long, you said? 57 years. Wow. I've been in prison for... Fi it, well, she might not be in a dungeon. She might just be house arrest. 
it is in house arrest, but she might. It's just been like she's been in COVID for fifty years. <laughs> Gosh. I don't know why though. Why she's a Catholic? <laughs> That's why COVID. Well. God, when is this war going to fucking end, Gerard? I'm at what? I'm at positive, man. I'm I just want a battle. I'm sieging now again. You're sieging. This is how all of my wars are. They're painful, man. Your wars suck, dude. Yeah. I need to make better wars. I need more military. I've been blowing all my money so quickly. I'm up to 28 gold. And, and then make her pay you for it. <laughs> Give me 25 gold. I'm just going to seduce her. <laughs> God. No. I, I don't have the thing to, to ask for money. What is that? It's under... Um, I can't remember. It's probably under stewardship. I feel like I should have a higher chance of murdering these people than what it says. Um, well, it depends on your intrigue skill. Yep. Yours is X, which is not the biggest. Um, you might have just gotten a, not the best character. But she's 37, so one day she will pass and things will maybe get inherited by someone else. That is all true. Yeah, we've all had to deal with a bad ruler. Oh my god, yes. Literally, I was relieved when my wife killed me. And then my son inherited everything. I was like, oh, thank goodness. Because that guy was a piece of shit. Well, I'm glad you died then. Uh... Yeah, you know who my you know who my wife was? Keegan's daughter, dude. Keegan's daughter murdered me. Uh no, it was uh Strel's daughter. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> God damn it. I could go look. Yeah, actually it's very easy to go look. I'll go look. Parents, parents, parent. Was it Ihanti? At this point it's a distant relative. No, not even. It was. Man, I have too many children. Oh my god. It was Max Danger, wasn't it? it was Max, Max's father. Oh, it was pa uh, Pivo. He okay. was murdered by Princess Freya Strelstotter. <laughs> Damn, you're good. How'd you remember that shit? That was. I was joking, but my jokes often end up being made. <laughs> There's truth to every joke, they say. Huh. Let's see. Oh, 52%? Damn, I have 147 living members. Oh, I'm really losing weight. Good work. Should I host a feast? I was gonna say I wish I could invite you to a feast. Yeah. You should uh you should celebrate. Ooh, I'm getting five renown per month, dude. That's pretty good. But what will I spend it on, you know?
Are we done fighting this war? <laughs> <laughs> you know, we, we all really want it to be over, okay? I'm about to lose yeah. the other the other contract that you helped me pay for is about to expire. They're asking the same questions. Can I just watch myself get fatter? Like a blip and then boop? <laughs> It is, man. Man, there was like something that allowed you to like purchase land. Was it like a. Was it learning, maybe? Yeah, it was. That's what it was. Man, this is going to be so good. When we get out of war, I'm going to be earning so much money. I think we're going to wrap it up real, real soon. Shortly, yeah, I'm shortly. Yeah, fucking sure, dude, yeah. This war is going to be over any day now. This is like Vietnam of medieval times. <laughs> it has been like four or five years. Ah, okay. It looks like Brandy's vassals are starting to like her more. Heck yeah. There's, there's two that aren't a big fan, but, you know, they're working their way towards stuff. Um... It may be worth trying to swap out your steward, or, or hmm, I wish I could see your council somehow. Is there a way to do that? CK3, see other rulers, council. What do these guys have against me? Council positions are listed next to the relevant. All right, my queen is my soulmate, dude. What up? All right, we're off to a good start, you know? Six children already. I do need some younger concubines. What is a um, vassal war? A vassal what? Oh. Soul war. Uh, are your vassals fighting each other? Stop the vassal war. Oh, yeah, you don't care about those. Your vassals can fight each other, and it's fine, because it just makes your vassals weaker, and so they, they are less likely to fight you, because they're weak. Um, do you have any people on your council that are not, um powerful vassals like if you open your council and you look at the icons next to everybody's name uh, I mean where do I find how do I tell if they're powerful or... um it's got a red fist Burbank. Burbank. Yeah, to the bottom right of each character, there's going to be, there may or may not be a fist. Some of them will have one. So see if any of them don't have fists. Two people do not. Okay, which ones are they? Or is uh, it your, the well, Chancellor and the Court Chaplain. Okay, the um, Court Chaplain, uh, or, or sorry, the Chancellor, what skill do they have? affairs so it's to the right of the chancellor title that there'll be a number oh. diplomacy uh yeah what's the number there it says it's 
Oh, oh, okay. Sorry, I'm slow. Uh, it's six. Six. Okay, so what you can do is here's what I would do. Go ahead and set... Do you have Duchess Sophia on your council? Actually. Yes, I do. She's my uh, steward. Sorry, I was choking. Okay. Can you click the, the little cycle button next to the chancellor and then set Duchess Sophia to be your, your chancellor? Okay. Okay, now your steward's open, right? Swap them. Uh... Well, you want, so you, you don't want to, the only person you want to fire was the person who is not your vassal, or, or not your powerful vassal. So you can get rid of them, and that's fine. But what the place you want to be at is you want Duchess Sophia to be your chancellor, and then you want to recruit Baron Piho to be your steward. That'll make him like you more, and he has a good stewardship skill. He has 13. Hello, I'm back. <laughs> He's just asking where you went. Oh, I said BRB. I just went to go grab water. And pee. He went to go grab water. Nice. Do you think he's going to pee as well? I was thinking he might. Nice! Some lately? I have not actually. Let's see. Been growing. I see. Alba's still a pain over there, huh? Yeah, I was. I feel like I'm gonna leave them for last and then just roll in and stomp the shit out of them. <laughs> How do you keep it together after you die? I've just been, uh... Look, I, I'm getting somebody that's good... That I, that likes me a whole lot, and, and, uh... Making sure that the people... That, you know, all my vassals are happy. That, if the vassals are generally happy, then, um... You have a lot, you have a lot less trouble coming in. I see. They all want some shit. It's kind of a balance, though, because I'm not... I don't know exactly what I'm doing, you know? God damn it, I wish I'd gotten a wife that wasn't... That, I, that would actually have kids with me. Because uh, this one ain't. There's a little bit of infighting, Todd. But, uh... Once this war is over, we'll have this cleaned up, and then I'll pop this one. I gotta figure out what to do about that. Uh, I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna lose this land or whatever. Realm will lose land when vassal dies. I'll lose that whole section there. So, I don't know. Just expand north and you'll have borders similar to modern Finland. <laughs> That's all Keegan's. Can't do that to Keegan, you know? 
Although it's probably bedtime. But I'll at least finish this damn war. Did you finish your work? What's going on? I think we're about to once one of these damn sieges complete. Oh, yeah. The ones that I'm doing over here? Doing all the heavy lifting? I'm doing. Mm -hmm. And then is your kingdom going to finally be at peace? Yeah. But I have other problems to worry about afterwards. There we go. Bam. Enforce demands. Okay. Whew, all right. Thank you, Keegan. No problem. Let dude. me know when you need money or, I don't know, or people, children. Uh, if you want, you can help dig Brandy out of a home. Okay. So I'm not sure the best option there. Are we still allied? No. All right, there. Oh, I can, view, right. I can view her kills. Brandy, did you make uh, Baron Piho your uh, uh, steward? Mm. I'll, uh, one second, let me take a picture. Yeah. I just did. Okay. Uh, so that helps with your goal a little bit. Um, here, Brandy, I have a, have a beautiful daughter. There you go. Okay. So, uh, Brandy, one of the things that I would suggest is telling your marshal um, to, if they don't, if they aren't already increasing count, control in the county. To tell them to increase control in Cargapol, um, because that's your main, like, title, and it will provide you the most money, I think, when you get it under control. Let me look at one more, just to be sure. Yeah. <laughs> What's that's the skill it. of your marshal, by the way? Todd said, why is Keegan talking about his Baron pee hole? Oh, that's even worse. He's talking about Brandy's Baron pee hole. Inappropriate for stream. Um, his... is Marshall. He's 21. Uh, oh, okay. So, yeah. Click the little grave icon. You know? Uh, yeah, totally. the, the, <laughs> and then um, click on uh, cargo pole, which is your, it's kind of like your main city. It's the one that your emblem is next to. Okay, I got it. Okay. So now over the next couple of years, they'll work on getting that under control and you'll start to get more taffas from it. it once it goes up to 100 control, it should, you should actually start gaining money. Awesome, thank you. Hey, yeah, nice. I, that was a beautiful daughter. Okay. A daughter? A daughter. I remember when we used to play that. <laughs> Doctor two. Yep. All 
All right. Ooh, not looking good near death, huh? You are? No, no, no. Oh. One of my vassals. Oh, while you were gone, I was saying we should probably let's probably call it, my man. Okay. Are you, is everyone at a good stopping point? I mean, it's never the best stop. It's never the best. Here, wait. You know what? I do. Let me, let me gift uh, that queen. Oh, it only lets me gift it by 225? How, how does it calculate that? I only have 100. How do I gift less, Keegan? Uh, what? I was trying to send Brandy money, but it says I don't have 225 gold to send her. How do I send less than that? Oh, I don't think you can. Why does it why does it expect me to send her two hundred twenty five gold? Who knows how it figures that number out? Uh, uh, Can we so stingy, Gerard? <laughs> I just don't have it. I literally don't have it. You can't send more than you got. You're doing good. I get plus 11.5 gold per turn now. Yeah, I'm at 6.1. I've just been upgrading the hell out of everything. Let's see here. Oh no, it died from smallpox. Sheesh, man. It happens. None of my siblings like me. That can happen. Um, actually, a lot of people don't like you because you've been in debt for 10 years. I think that's one of the big ones. Ah. Uh... Gives a Thanks for... Cool. <laughs> but... I'm not sure how we can totally nail you with that. I mean, it's fine. He, I, I believe... Getting control of your main city, because it is currently being worked on. Um, it increases by one every month. And as it increases, you will start to get more taxes from it. You could go raiding. The problem with that is you have to pay for the army. Um, do you have any prisoners that you could ransom off? Uh, if, you, if you press tab, there is a section that will sometimes say prisoners can be ransomed. You might have to scroll down. <laughs> Do you need lolly transferred? Me? I was say, I don't know, man. They they want to join some uprising against me. What? You know what? Last time I didn't free these people. So did you see? Is there a tab that says uh, prisoners can be ransomed, uh, Brandy? I don't have any prisoners. Okay, that's fine then. Oh yeah, did we need to come to a stopping point, Jerry? Yeah. Okay. Brandy, All you had right. a good stopping point? 
Yeah, I'm down. I'll, uh, right, as long as I remember, I'll send you some money next go. I just need to accumulate some crazy amount so that I yeah, can I'll... send you a gift. I think the control is the biggest problem. And the fact that you're a little bit in debt. Is there a bankruptcy option? <laughs> no, yeah. And, and that's the other thing is that it's harder to control when you're in in when you've been in debt for so long it's it's just a you negative you just gotta focus on yourself for a while you can't expand you can't fight right you take this a screenshot a lot like my life <laughs> <laughs> um yeah everyone's just saying like control is super important um oh that makes sense you've been oh wait okay so Good night, Todd. Thanks for checking in. Yeah, good night, um, stream. Uh, let me save this for everybody here, and I'll do some. I'll see if there's any.